Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Live. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you having a Hyundai Tucson with a gasoline engine, guys. And uh, it doesn't matter what year generation or engine you have, as long as it's gasoline engine. And if you have engine oil in the spark plugs, we'll explain what can cause that and how to fix it because it can cause misfires that can actually lead to uh, your engine dying and you can get in a really dangerous situation. While we're making video that video, because many of you requested in the comment section below. So let's go ahead and explain what can cause engine oil in the spark plug holes. Let me tell you a little bit about us. Every single car we get at the garage, we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos. Why we do that? Simply because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, that way we can keep providing this free information to you. Now, if you guys need to buy two parts for a really good price and quick shipping as well, check out the link in the description of the video below and you can see where we get all our tools and supplies from. So before we start, okay, uh, let me show you what we did here. We removed the valve cover, okay. If you want to see how to remove valve cover on Hyundai Tucson, we have the step-by-step -step video that will teach you how to do that. Now, right here you can see guys in the cylinder head, okay, we have four, okay, four spark plugs, one, two, three, four. Uh, this cylinder number one, two, three, and four respectively, starting on the very left side by the belt, okay, will be cylinder number one and you go in order. Let's say you remove your spark plug or ignition coil and that hole right here of the spark plugs is full of engine oil. Okay, that is actually something really normal that you can expect to see on an older engine but it needs to be fixed as soon as possible because you can actually lose power, the engine can die from misfires and you can get in an accident. Now, what causes that? Okay, it's usually only one thing guys and this is failing valve cover gasket. Why? Because the valve cover gasket back in the day it used to be just the outside part of the gasket, right? Right here. Because the spark plug used to be kind of like in an angle, but now the spark plugs on the dual overhead cam, you have two camshafts are right in the middle of the engine. So we have a, a spark plug part of the valve cover gasket, okay, right here. That's valve cover gasket as well, but it's for the spark plugs. On some models you may have the two where they're separated, and they come in two different pieces or on some they're just one piece with the valve cover gasket when that gasket fails guys okay what happens when it fails it will start dripping engine oil in the spark plug wells which will make the spark plug wet on top and the communication between the ignition coil and the spark plug will be compromised and you can get misfire Another thing that can lead to that, okay, it's very important, when you replace the valve cover gasket, make sure you clean everything really good, and you need to use the, the uh, torque specs, okay, the appropriate, okay, the, uh, the torque specs for the valve cover and the bolt sequence. If you don't do it right, okay, you can over tighten it or not tighten it too much, and that can lead to leaking oil in the spark plugs again. So, if you don't know about that, we have a special video about the valve cover torque specs on that 2.4 GDI engine. Check it out, and it will teach you how to do that. Hopefully, the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching, and see you guys next time.